morning queens good morning good morning so today is november 9th of 2012 and it is a friday so in preparation of the sabbath every friday we have a prayer call which is usually led by either ashabi or me so tonight i'm going to be leading and we're talking about healing from the past okay so if you are free tonight at 9 p.m eastern standard time then come to the prayer call and when you come bring a knife okay bring a knife biggest knife you can find okay because we are going to be ceremoniously cutting soul ties to past experiences events relationships people ideas whatever whatever we have that roots us in the past we're going to be cutting it off tonight i'm going to show you how so i have a few things to share and then we're going to begin cutting so a soul tie in case you don't know what it is, is anything that mentally, emotionally, or behaviorally connects you to past, past three, uh, emotions and relationships and things people said. So if um, you find yourself using a certain vocabulary, words you picked up from someone else in your past, or you have certain ideas about yourself that originated from someone else or some relationship or some encountering or something somebody said, uh, those things need to be cut off. Um, if you have diet practices or a certain religious practice and these things are not quite fitting your body, fitting your mentality, fitting your spirit, then those things need to be cut out of your your vibration and in, in, in out of your auric field so let's talk a little bit about the energy uh, body because well this is the energy that surrounds your body it's about as far out as, as your extended arms all the way around your body and this energy field is constantly communicating with other people's energy fields all day now when you engage in a conversation with someone somebody you trust and believe and you're all open to them uh, they can speak into your energy field now this this energy field holds all emotions experiences everything that's had an impact psychologically or spiritually emotionally um, in our past some of those things need to be cut out. This is a minor spiritual surgery, and I invite you to participate, okay? Um, and I, I do want um, to warn anyone who may be on the call, first of all, we are not going to be rehashing or talking about these old experiences. We're going to be cutting them. The third, uh, the, the, the second thing to... Ooh, to know is um, that once you do cut, and I, in all fairness, maybe I should have um, told you guys this, this early in the week, but I didn't know we was going to be talking about this until God told me in the shower. Yes, God talks to me in the shower. So anyway, so the second thing to know is that once you start cutting these things, they're going to start coming up. I like all the blood, you know. The people that you cut off spiritually, they're going to call you. They're going to get in touch with you. are going to see them somewhere. They, whatever is on the other end of Whatever what you about to cut off is kind of like cutting an umbilical cord. When you cut that off, whatever is on the other side, they're gonna feel the jolt. They're gonna think about you, and they may try and get back in touch with you. So, uh, be pre prepared for that. Third thing is to get in a space where you are allowing. Just before the call, you don't have to do this all day. Where you are allowing those things to rise up, and you really don't have to do that because once we get in the call, we get into that meditative space. Those things will come up naturally. Okay, so come to the prayer call if you're free tonight, November the 9th, two thousand and twelve, Friday, in preparation of the Sabbath. We have a prayer call. All sisters, queens only. Come and bring your knife, the biggest knife you can find. I want machetes out there. Okay, so bring bring your knives, and when you do, be prepared for some spiritual healing, right? So we can cut those things out of your energy field. So you can go into a new galactic year with fresh energy and with good vibration, high vibration and freeness. Okay, I love you so much. I'll see you later. Thank you. Bye.